Hey, Roger here at NAB New York. We're showing off the Shogun Ultra and the Ninja Ultra, our next generation Atom OS 11 Atomos products. Uh, the difference between this and the old ones is that the Ultra now can do 4K proxies. It'll have EL zone false colors and RE false colors, and also remote view, which is a C2C or camera to cloud capability that we added onto both of the Ultras. And uh, we also added just for the Ultras, SDI file naming. So if you're using a Canon, Sony, Ari, or RED camera, the SDI out file naming will match, so the metadata will be 100% at this point. So you won't have the normal naming conventions of the Atomos units. So at uh, NEB, we're showing off the camera to cloud capability plus all the new Ultra capabilities and the new Atom OS. As you see, all the items have been a little cleaned up, so it looks a lot cleaner. Still has all the features like your waveform, RGB parade, vector scope, your uh, focus peaking, zebra, uh, false colors, which is Atomos false colors, uh, blue hues, and safe zones. Every monitor feature is built in and is not camera dependent, so you can do pretty much anything. We also work with HDMI or SDI sources, so those are inputs. Uh, we can detect, we can do triggers, we can legalize an automatic HDR for you as well if you shoot in log. We output the same HDMI or SDI, so, and they're both hot at the same time. So you can use both the HDMI and SDI to do separate sources. This gives it the ability to connect to Frame.io or custom RTMPs. I have it going to NAB New York right now, so just to do a little clip to show you, if I press record, I can say hello, I are you and then stop. Over here shows that the file is uploading and then it will pop up here in the frame. Uh, if you have any other questions, visit us at animals.com or uh, talk to your local representative. Thank you.